There's a large population in the country which is internally displaced and the constant movement of women in search of safety often makes it difficult to move family planning commodities where they are needed as populations shift based on safety concerns in an often very unpredictable manner. Natural disasters like flooding often destroy commodities when they reach health facilities and also this flooding makes it difficult and rather very challenging for women to travel to service delivery points to access family planning methods. A friend in my community is a mother of six children. She attended a community outreach event on family planning where she learned about all types of family planning methods. She went and discussed with her partner and he openly accepted that they use a form of birth control. This decision impacted her life because she realized she can be a mother while focusing on a job. She can earn money to send her children to school. While she is currently pregnant with her third child, she is very worried how being continually pregnant will have impact on her career. By sharing her concerns, she recently learned that there are contraceptive methods that can help her take control in the, in the planning of her family. I advocate for women having access to family planning methods because women like my friend can be mothers while also being a wife, a, a sister, a colleague, a friend and a career professional. Women are and continue to be valuable members of communities through South Sudan.